All right. Um, we've been informed that the Kaiser Chiefs and uh, Stellenbosch FC have agreed a deal in principle. Uh, I know you are asking, Bones, what is a deal in principle? Well, I'm going to unpack, don't worry. I'll unpack all of this. But we've been told that the Kaiser Chiefs and uh, e Stellenbosch have agreed a deal in principle uh, for the transfer of um, um Tetua. Then, Bones, take me into confidence. I know you say that. Don't worry. If you are interested, please stick around. As you stick around, there's only one favor that I'm requesting from you, and that favor is that you subscribe, you like the video, and you comment in the comment section below. Why do you need to do all of these things? You need to do it because doing it, it does help out a lot when it comes to the YouTube algorithm to promote and spread this video to as many people as possible. So definitely, good people, the power here is in your hands. Speaking about that, now, Aibo, Aibo, things are happening uh, between Kaiser Chiefs and Stellenbosch. It appears like sooner or later we might see or we might well welcome them. Um, in a statement that was posted or in an article released by E. Itisky Times, um, they released the following. This is what they said. Uh, well, where's the statement now? Uh, okay, according to, uh, wait a minute. According to the citizens, Mteta will join Chiefs in the upcoming transfer window, but will have to put some uh, something out of the ordinary if they want to sign Umen Yeta. So, guys, I said it is E. Ilendole. I said it is E. Ilendole. E. It is Kitams, but it's the citizens. So they continue to say again um, uh, they they want sponsor him Teto and junior mediator but, uh, but as things stands it is um, Teto who will join them Stelis have technically uh, have technically agreed to release him Teto and coach Steve Parker is already working on finding a replacement for him I don't think he will he will play much in the remaining games as ba as Barker has already identified youngster who wants to who whom a youngster he wants to groom into the position but i don't see them releasing mediator yet unless money is really good for both players and the club said a source to the publication right so uh so right if if usually when teams are created deal on principle chances of that deal to collapse are very slim once they've agreed a deal uh but mediator uh, look, it, it, it's clear that Icarus teams need a defensive midfielder. So, do I believe or disbelieve stories like this? I honestly believe that it is actually very happening. And then, because it is clear that Icarus teams need a defensive midfielder. That's why others are even saying that Icarus teams must go and sign the likes of Abo, the likes of Abo and Lechali, which a lot of people don't agree based on his behavior. Um, an alleged behavior of alcohol, you know, but we, we don't have a proof for that. That's why we will have to use the word alleged as it has been reported by other news publications. So because of that, I don't think other ships will want to be associated with U and Lejali. So in replacement for that, we have, we've always known that one day, we might see Usbong Senem Tetra joining Ikaiza Chiefs. So if you don't see Usbong Senem Tetra playing in the Lokuma matches with Stellenbosch, just know that uh, look, the, the sources has revealed that they are saving him because they want to groom another player so that they can sell him to Kaiser Chiefs as injury free as possible because they've already agreed a deal. Because the two teams seem to enjoy a good relationship. And Ukulokuko's new sporting director promise that he's gonna sign players that also uh fans are interested to see each other chip signing and sponsor him tetra is one of those players get into the comment section below tell me what you think you and i will see each other in the next video but until the next video good people please take care